too complex. Welcome back guys, my name is Kirby. <laughs> Today we're making a Alexino pattern for you because we got this request right here. <laughs> James, yo, I actually figured out how to do it. Instead, how about Alexino's routine from here? It sounds so damn clean, cheers. Kirby, James, yeah, sure. I said I was gonna do it, I went out and did it. <laughs> so that video is called Alexinho, French Beatbox Champion. You can check that video out right in the description. I put that link down there. You can skip that video to 1 minute and 10 seconds because from there, that's where I'm making the tutorial. From there and to the end. In this video, he uses Starsky Bass a lot. So that's why I get a minute tutorial on the Starsky Bass while we're going. So actually, Alexino made a tutorial on the Starsky Bass. It's basically making the sound you do when you're gonna spit like <laughs> that kind of sound when you like drink water and be like <laughs> when you clear your throat in that way and then you keep that vibration and then you vocalize it also then you make a lip synth on that and the lip synth is <laughs> I have a tutorial for the lip synth you can check that out in the description you keep your lips in that lip synth <laughs> and then you make that <laughs> When you find that sweet spot, when you feel like, yeah, this sounds pretty good, that's why when you're gonna apply more pressure. So, <laughs> to me, this feels like it's a lot of slip synths going on, like. <laughs> like spamming a lot of lip synth and maybe that's the feeling you're supposed to get as well. If you want to make a higher pitch Starsky bass, you make the lip synth much uh, higher pitch. <laughs> maybe make the hole a bit smaller. <laughs> also, you can be saying like whoa, 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 whoa while doing it, but don't overdo that. Say like whoa, 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 whoa. Not overdo it, so... You kind of want to keep that very small hole because that's very important to get these Starsky bass uh, sound good. So it's kind of important that you apply more and more pressure and make the kind of hard, so... But only when you have the sweet spot. In this beat, the Starsky bass will change from a higher pitch, a lower pitch, to higher pitch, so... For this pattern, you also will need the K-snare, obviously. And also the vocalized K-snare, I will type that as this, and... It's almost like a vocalized uh, rim shot. It's the K-snare or the rim shot. And you say um 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 Then you will need the outward K, the and also the double K, or if you want to make it like outward and inward. That's what I'm gonna do. So I guess you could also do like. But for me, it's easier to go like... It's just a K outward. And then a K inward. You're saying K inwards, no K snare, just K inwards right in the middle of your tongue. If you can't do that, you can stick with... You will also need the vocalized trap hi-hat, the... I will type that as You will also need that air synth and that I'll link a tutorial in the description if you want to learn that Also you will need the inward lip roll I also have a tutorial for that, check the description down below Before viewing you the whole pattern and showing you the beatbox script I wanted to go through some patterns that Alexinho does in this routine That you can learn before attempting to make this whole 
uh, routine. So the first thing you will have to practice is this. So it's outward K. So after that, it's either or or so the first round it's gonna go like and the second round now is and then now the last round so try to practice that try to get that down uh, you can practice just one if you think it's complicated to do all of these threes at the same time just practice one at a time so now I took the first one and did all over again and you can practice that in the beginning and then you can get uh, to change that little part there so you should also be able to make the K snare and then inward lip roll right after if you master that then you should also be able to make the PEH snare before so and you might be able to make the all by itself first and then you add a lip roll also you could practice that very much similar and then the fastest pattern Alex Senior does in this routine is the I use that but you can use that outward K if you want to. You should practice that as well all by itself. Alexinho actually does it a bit faster than me, but I can't really make it that fast. If you got all of that, then I think you're ready to make the routine. I will view the beatbox script right here while I do it myself and you can hang on as good as you can and you can lower the speed if you want to. You probably will need to do that in the beginning and then you're able to practice in the speed that suits you the best. Let's go. <laughs> Up the eight and up the pace and beat and crawl, have fun. This is a shout out for Kuma. We mash up the eight and up the pace and and this is a shout out for Swiss beatbox. I hope that worked out for you. Like every pattern and every routine, you gotta practice a lot on it before getting good at it. And uh, that's what I had to do myself. If you have any questions or if you struggle and you need help, just put a comment down below and I will try to help you out as good as I can. Thanks for watching my tutorials and thanks for 1,500 subscribers. That means a lot. Without further ado, leave a like, leave a comment, share the video and subscribe because more is coming and my name is Kirby. <coughs> and I am out.